Hey, it's a great day at Mills Motors, 240 Bond Street East in Oshawa. Let's take a look here at the 2020 GMC Sierra 2500 HD Denali trim. You got the 6.6 .6 liter Duramax diesel engine here. You get the chrome accents on the front grille, the front parking sensors. Prep pack for gooseneck and fifth wheel all ready to go. Got the fog lights up front. 20 inch gloss aluminum wheels, all terrain tires, your Duramax diesel badging, and you also have the assist steps door to door elongated. And I'm point out here that you also have the new integrated side step here into the uh, 2500. So that's going to allow you to pull yourself into the uh, truck a little bit easier to grab something out from this area. And as you can see, that you do have the liner there now we're going to take a closer look at that tailgate in just a minute but first of all let's just climb in got the tow mold here your four-wheel drive select cargo lights on off and you do have the task lights so you can engage those by pressing this button right here and when you do so you're going to get that bright led light that shines there from the uh, back of the mirror caps and that's only going to work in park, so you can't accidentally uh, cause problems for the drivers on the road. And you have the uh, cameras of the mirrors mounted here. So even if you fold the mirrors in and out, which we'll show you in just a second, that's not going to change the camera view. So that's a nice little bonus there for you. All right, so we're just going to reach in and uh, disengage those task lights here. And do want to point out you've got the nice wood grain trim finish, memory seat and memory mirror with two presets. And you're quite used to seeing the power folding mirror, so just press this button right here to see those folding mirrors slide into place. And another great safety feature available here for you is the driver blind spot system. And in addition to the uh, power folding mirrors, you also have the ability to move those mirrors left and right. So that's going to give you a very comfortable view. Perhaps you're not uh, totally used to seeing the... Uh, trailer view or you're not used to driving a truck this size imagine how much easier that's going to be for you because you can move those mirrors not only side to side but in and out as well got the sunroof above the Denali stitching into the headrests and power driver adjustable seat with lumbar support plenty more to see so let's climb on in and start taking a look around this 2020 2500 HD Denali all right, so we are indoors today here, and uh, the engine's not turned on. We're in a, uh, accessory mode, so that's why you'll see the engine light there. But I assure you, there's no problems with the vehicle. You've got the uh, Denali branding once again, and you've got the uh, gap adjustment. So you can set that up for different distances, and it's going to keep you informed of the flow of traffic around you. And you do have a heated steering wheel. You can turn that on and off right there. Your cruise control leather wrap steering wheel and your head-up display which is larger and brighter and uh, it doesn't translate the camera particularly well but uh, of course uh, looks very good in person so you can uh, utilize that and we have had questions before about how you turn it off you can just uh, turn down the intensity the brightness and that way you won't be able to see it anymore so always available to you but if it's uh, something you don't want to use very easy to uh, get that to disappear off the uh, windshield itself got the uh, gear shifter over here on the right hand side and you're also going to find the hands-free calling and voice command and the driver information center menu over here on the right and volume control behind the steering wheel there uh, and it is Bose audio too so you're getting the uh, best possible sound push start ignition onboard navigation with turn by turn Apple CarPlay Android Auto built right in and we're going to go right to the uh, camera views here so you have uh, a multitude of camera views available to you and uh, of course uh, as you know we are inside so you're going to see a little bit of a different view here uh, around us you can see a surround view and when you punch this one up you can actually see the side of the truck here so if you're moving in and out of uh, some tight corners we got the trailer hooked up it's going to make life a little bit easier for you. you can actually punch that up and see the road around you and you do have the uh hitch view as well and for the first time ever you've got a bed view there as well so you can uh, uh, keep a, a look at the load you've got there or uh, it's going to help you with a uh, goose neck and fifth wheel and the, the interior trailer view camera you can uh, get one of those and hook that up and it's going to show you the inside of the trailer 
You've got the transparent trailer view, so you've uh, heard about that. It's going to allow you to pull a trailer but see the road around you as if there was nothing there. So it's a nice little addition. And uh, all those different camera views, a class leading 15 different possibilities when you factor in those add-ons. Heated and cooled seats, both driver and passenger side. Hill descent control, you got your exhaust brake, and the lane departure warning system. So when that's engaged, it's going to kind of uh, take a, a stock accessory of the road around you. So it's going to let you know whether it's uh, safe to make a move or not. And that's going to be especially helpful when you've got that trailer with you. Parking sensors on off. Power down tailgate button. It is multi-pro. We're going to see that in just a minute. Got your hazards, traction control. And this will control the power running in and out of the uh, 400 watt outlet in the tailgate, which again, we'll see in just a minute. Three prong, 12 volt, USB, USB-C, and your trailer brake. And right here, you can find that you have your wireless charging dock, cup holders, and that's where I have the key fob resting right now. I'll take a quick look at that. Shows that you have the remote starts, the t power down tailgate button, and you also have the uh, alarm function. Storage space within, you've got USB, USB-C and auxiliary. All weather floor mats, front and rear. Double glove box, the lower portion will lock. And above, you're gonna find the controls for the sunroof. Manual sunshade above. And this button will control the sliding rear mirror, a uh, sliding rear camera alloy. So we'll take a look here in the mirror. And that's the last thing we're going to talk about here is the camera view. All right, so now as you can see, this is punched up to see the actual mirror. Now I flip this back you're getting a larger and brighter display. Uh, the effect here, of course, isn't as great because we are indoors, but you can increase and increase, uh, increase and decrease the uh, brightness of the camera and tilt it up and down. All right, very cool. So we're gonna take a now look at that uh, multi-pro tailgate. All right, so we're gonna check out the uh, multi-pro tailgate. Now, the first thing we're gonna do is take a look at the power down tailgate button here uh, on the key fob. So that's gonna fold down for you as soon as you use that. You do have the larger tailgate steps here on both left and right. So that's gonna accommodate any size uh, work boot, any size shoe, you're good to go. And again, the lighting above the wheel wells and you do have that new integrated uh, step there at the side of the vehicle. There's your hookup for fifth wheel and gooseneck prep packs. Cargo lights, 400 watt power and your tie downs, which you have a total of 12 fixed eye downs you can have a total of 21 all together and here on the left hand side you've got the uh, grab bar there so you can help pull yourself in and out of the truck and you've got the uh, seven and four pin connectors here once again so that's going to allow for greater accessibility for hooking up uh, different trailer situations because perhaps these ones here won't be as useful to you if you have a trailer uh, fifth wheel and gooseneck hooked up. Just a little bit of a, a different view for you. And you have heavy duty hookups there. LED light that shines down towards the hitch when you have the uh, cargo lights enabled as we do now. And I did point out to you earlier that you have the uh, hitch view camera. Well, as soon as you throw the hitch view camera on, you're going to get that LED light to uh, shine in, the cargo lights to turn on as well. So that's going to give you a greater opportunity for uh, allowing for hookups for trailer and hitch. All right. So I'm going to engage those buttons by pressing twice. And it's going to fold on down just like so. And that's going to allow you to uh, lean on in and grab whatever equipment you have back here. Maybe you've got some off-road vehicles. It's going to help you just uh, lean in because it's sort of a carved out section here in that multi-pro tailgate. And one further step will allow you to turn this into an integrated step itself. Now do remember I'm doing everything with one hand on the camera here. Put that back in position. And if I press just the first button here, I can get the uh, top portion to fold down. 
got a little workspace there perhaps and again you can pull this section up here and now you have a bed extender for all intents and purposes and you do have multi-tier uh, stacking available so you can uh, buy accessories here to allow for multi-tier or you can simply cut some pieces of lumber that's uh, to a specific size there and put those in and they're going to work just as well for you and your Sierra badging over here in the right hand side and of course those rear parking sensors as well all right, take a look at the rear of the vehicle and you have the all-weather floor mats once again. You do have rear heated seats, USB, USB-C, 12 volt, overhead lighting and a large roof line. 60-40 split bench seat in there in the back, soft touch materials, wood grain trim notes and again the uh, deep tinted glass. Another look there at that powered sliding rear window and you have the storage space built right into the seats here on both left and right hand sides and that's going to do it for your look at the 2020 gmc sierra 2500 hd denali trim if you want to see this one in person you can do so at mills motors 240 bond street east in oshawa where we always do whatever it takes